It's the weekend! Is it? I mean, it... Isn't it Thursday? Yeah. It's always the weekend for me, except the actual weekend. Those are my for sure work days. So I, I'm a little bit off all the time. Speaking of for the weekend, though, this vodka lemonade is a little large. So we got a Bisma and a Eileen's Frost Rider. Frost Rider's good. I believe that we are playing a primal one. You don't work Fridays. Fair enough. No, and oh, right. This is the one where we were like stuck between playing Shadow and Primal, wasn't it? What new cards did we get? Slasher. Final Shot Rioter is kind of nice. Vainglory is pretty good. Could definitely see taking a Vainglory. Okay, let's take a look at what the primal cards were. Iceberg Warchief I don't care about. Thunderfoot. Frost Rider I do. Right, we had Adaptive Predator, Frost Rider, False Prince if we want to do that. Skywalk Instructor is here. One of the big problems is we just don't have nearly as much removal if we take out the shadow. We lose end of the line, we lose uh, banish, we lose, like, eh, I guess it's only those two, end of the line and banish, but still, that's actually still fairly significant. Two removal spells turning into one, and the one removal spell not being particularly great, just static bolt. Any time cards we can add. Trailmaker is nice, if we're gonna have these colors. We can go down and do a little bit less shadow. I might actually slowly cut out, like, Corrupted Umbrin, too. Although, this, oh, these are all double shadow, too. Mm. Yeah, they're making ranking up a little bit easier. Wow, we did not get a lot of extra time cards, that's for sure. Okay, what about Justice? Crack Shot Fugitive is okay. Tandem Watch Wing is fine. Shielded Short Barrel is really good, I could see playing that. Oh, Bullrich, I don't normally do uh, song requests except on sub-Sundays. Which, by the way, this Sunday is going to be all of the decks that were submitted, I'm going to play them. Anybody that subs that particular day gets one, and then on Sundays we play through them. Hey, Skinny Taco! Good to see you. It's just nice to have some VODs that are unmuted and stuff too, right? Thinking of cutting Corrupted Umbrin, it's good, but it's also slow. Double Shadow is hard, is why. Should we maybe take out Victor's Cry? We put in Shielded Short Barrel instead. Hmm. 
These are all really close. We have an interesting deck now. All that double shadow is such a problem. Alright, I'll do that. We'll leave all the shadow to be, like, double cost stuff that's late, or the couple of early removal spells and, like, you know, Surgeon Saw and stuff. Sandglass is nice. Yeah, Sandglass Parma is okay. We don't have that many sevens. We have one seven, two Direwoods. Eh, we have Civic Peacekeeper too, I suppose, but I'm not super excited about it. I think we've got better things to do. I can only run so many attachments is the thing, right? And I think we're running our maximum, as it were. Alright. 